So now I have the VLF here. We have our coil here. And very, very simple here assembly. This part goes into this part, this part goes into this part, that part goes into that part, and we're done. So now step by step. What I have here is our first part here. I'm just simply going to slide it in between here. Take our little nylon nut, put it in here, line it all up, put it through the holes, and then tighten it up. So I'm just going to push this through. There we go. Coming through on the other side. Yes, it is. Then at this moment in time, I'm going to take the nut here. This is all nylon. Do not replace this with a metal nut because this is a metal detector. So if you put the metal right on there at the same time, you're gonna end up with this really negative effect. So at this moment in here, we wanna extend it out. Flip the switch up here, the handle here. This extends the one area out. Flip this one up here. That extends this one here. And so now I'm going to take this I want to put the cable around here. I'm just going to twist this a couple of times to get the freedom. I'm going to check for my height. How do you check for your height? You're going to have a very comfortable hand position. You're going to be swinging this level with the ground. Now at this point, we know our height here. I'm going to take the cable, wrap it up fairly snug up against the thing here. And we have this little Velcro here. I'm going to secure this up here onto the grip here so that it doesn't go and fly away on us. Then I'm going to take our connector, make sure our connector is lined up. We're going to put the connector in, white to white. Go ahead and put it in, give it a little twist, locks it into place. So we're going to start off here with the VLF. I'm gonna push on the button here. This is a very, again, simple menu. This is different preset selections, which will go through different ranges here. And as you see here, I have different frequencies that I can select if I don't wanna have the lower frequencies and I only want the higher frequencies, or you can use a simple preset. If I say I wanna have a preset here, let's say I'm looking for more of the natural ores and things like that or I want to select what I want to hear and what I don't want to hear. So if I only want this range, I select this here and I can select my frequencies. When I'm happy with this, I can hit the button, follow the instructions, hold the pentacoil flat above the surface, do not move during ground balance process, start now. There's a countdown timer, it's going to beep, it's ready to go. At this moment in time, I can begin to swing my detector and it's going to look for targets in the ground within this area. I have a nice little test target here. Then as I come across here, then I immediately have a signal here. I could change my sensitivity up or down. But now, as I said, I have a target old coin. I have tested it. We have verified it. It works. I thank you very much for watching this presentation. Because I am human, at least I think I am, I may have forgotten something. We have the user handbook. Please refer to that. Otherwise, if you have any other questions, feel free to contact us. Email, telephone, SMS. We're here for you. Thank you.